hello everyone if you ever wanted to block a website on google chrome whether to stay focused limit distractions or restrict access you are in the right place in this video i will walk you through a couple of simple methods to do it let's get started the easiest way to block websites on google chrome is by using an extension let's install it and set it up once Google Chrome is opened, go to the Chrome Web Store. In the search bar, type block site and hit enter. It's a well-known extension with millions of users, so you can rely on it for blocking websites effectively. I will go ahead and click on block site from the search results. Now, click on add to Chrome. Then select add extension when prompted. Once installed, Blockside will open a welcome screen. Click I accept to proceed. This will take you to the block list settings page, where you can start adding sites to block. If you want to access Blockside later, click the puzzle icon in the top right corner of Chrome, find Blockside, and click the gear icon to open settings. Now let's block a website using Blockside. For this demo, I will block Facebook. Click the Add to Block List button. In the input box, type facebook.com. Select facebook.com from suggested list and click Done. Now whenever you try to visit Facebook, Blocksite will prevent access. But here's the catch. Blocksite's free version only lets you block up to three websites. If you need more, you will have to upgrade to the paid version. So what if, if you want to block multiple websites without paying? Well, there's another method that works at the system level. By modifying the host file in Windows, we can block websites across all browsers, not just Chrome. Let's set it up. In the search bar down here, type Notepad. When Notepad appears, Right click it and select run as administrator. Once notepad opens, click file, open, then navigate to this path. In the bottom right corner, select all files to make sure you can see the hosts file. Select hosts and click open. This file controls how your computer accesses websites. By adding entries here, we can block sites completely. Now, let's add the website we want to block. This time, we will block Reddit. Simply type these lines at the bottom of the file. What this does is redirect Reddit to your own computer's IP, preventing it from loading. Click File, Save, then close Notepad. Next. I will open command prompt as administrator. So I will type cmd in the search bar. When command prompt appears, right click it and select run as administrator. Once opened, type this command and hit enter. This refreshes your system's DNS cache. So the website blocks take effect immediately. And that's it. Reddit is now blocked at the system level. Now that we have blocked Facebook using block site extension and Reddit using the hosts file, let's test whether these methods are actually working. I will go ahead and open Google Chrome and try to visit facebook.com. We can see a block site message preventing access. Now let's open a different browser like Edge or Firefox. I will go ahead with Edge and try visiting reddit.com. And there it is. You should see a can't reach this page or a similar error message. If the website still loads, restart your computer and try again. And that's it. Both methods work and now you know how to block websites on Google Chrome, whether it's just for your browser or at the system level. Which method worked best for you? Please let me know in the comments. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.